Welcome back guys. As you can see, we got some snow. Kind of took me by surprise a bit. I was uh, planning on doing another video today, but I gave Mark a bell this morning. I was like, I'm coming down. <laughs> Join me or don't. And um, yeah, beautiful. Wasn't quite ready for this. I haven't got all my winter gear ready yet, but um, got together what I could. Got the uh, hot tent from One Tigress that I used last week actually. And um, gonna get that up now. Well, there's snow dripping out the trees here, hopefully not rain. Um, I've got the tent up, it went up a lot quicker than the last time, knowing what I was doing this time. Uh, Matt's down, so I just need to get my sleep system in now, and I'm all set. That's the sleeping bag inside a bivy bag with my little pillow there as well. Just keeping that covered up. Uh, it's just going to stop ice, snow, whatever getting on it, making it wet. Down bags don't like getting wet.
Well, she's all set up, stove's in, all ready to roll. Um, still dripping a lot. It's kind of ice, I guess, melting and dropping out of the trees, but it should be cold enough soon to stop that from happening. And maybe we can have an outdoor fire as well. Let's see how much firewood we can collect, because it's more economical on the uh, stove. But I'm uh, just going to zip her up so no more is getting in there on the bed and uh, saw some wood. Are you wet, Mark? I'm a little bit damp. A little damp. Oh, I'm a little off. damp. Would you like a Would you like a brew? Oh yeah, go on then. Okay, stop taking the Mickey then. At least you could do something <laughs> while I'm cutting all the wood. Brew courtesy of 
Mark to warm me up as he's all nice warm and dry now. <laughs> yeah, got the, got the kettle on. Mm. As soon as it'll be time oh. to get that fire on. That feels so good. Yeah, we've got about half hour of light if that left and um, yeah. get that fire going. It's so nice out here though, isn't it, in the snow? It is. It's a yeah, shame nice. that it seems to be melting off the trees a bit. Yeah. I thought it would have lasted this, but maybe it will snow in the night. Yeah. Let's see. Maybe. At least it'll cool down and uh, <laughs> stop it from dripping. <laughs> Banging on our tents all night. <laughs> oh. Right, just a fire lighter and a match today. Nothing too special. And Mark's provided a load of kindling. Everything's cold and a little bit damp, so hopefully it will take. She's going. She struggled, but she's going. Oh. So grateful for the heat. Yeah. We haven't got tons of firewood. No. <laughs> Can hear uh, trees cracking and snapping from the weight of the snow. Yeah. And lumps of it falling down on the tents. <laughs> and us. And us. <laughs> and our chairs. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, get us going properly and have a beer. Yeah. Got to warm through a bit first <laughs> before a cold beer. Mine are in the snow <laughs> over there. We're just knocking some of the snow and ice off of these logs and drying them out by the fire here. We're getting sleeted on and ice is falling out the trees. It's uh, not the best. <laughs> My arse is uh, pretty wet from uh, getting up and down on this chair and then ice getting on it. The, str the fire is really struggling because we're trying to dry out wood around it, but uh, it's getting wet from, ow, <laughs> ice hit me on the we're finger. We're cold and we've got wet bums. Yeah. <laughs> so we'll probably have a beer around the fire and then probably get into our tents <laughs> and dry off a bit with our stoves. Oh God. Oh. <laughs> moved into the tent because we're just getting rained on out there basically not great in the, these cold conditions so I'm gonna light a fire lighter and get the stove going here and hopefully it won't take too much trouble This kindling has been sat in the snow. Oh, 
Well, you can hear the ice falling on the tent still. <laughs> Got the stove going and uh, <laughs> and now I'm gonna have a beer. Mark is making us some chaga tea so we can run that over when it's done. <laughs> How are you? Oh, there you are. I'm still making our tea. <laughs> <laughs> like, three hours later. <laughs> still making it. It takes time, perfection. Okay. Well, I'm getting back in my tent and drinking more of my beer then. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's lovely and warm in here. Right, she's burning now. So I'm putting a few bits on top just to make sure they're nice and dry before putting them in the stove. What is that? Oh no, you're gonna pour me, aren't you? Oh hello. Oh you didn't bring it. Well, I didn't I, I thought you was coming out. Oh, do I have to? <laughs> oh God, it is warm in here, isn't it? <laughs> Jesus. Welcome. Well, hi. We're going in the chair. Yeah, might as well. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Right, hang on. Here we go. Give me. Okay. Give me. Right, now, I prefer it with sugar. So this is the chaga tea. This is Andy's first time. It looks like pee, by the way. It's, oh, okay. it's not, I promise you. Well, here we go with the chaga. Got a bit of sugar in it, which adds some sweetness, but it's, it's subtle. Better than nettle or pine, in my opinion. Get some water on and boiling, and that's going to be for my instant mash. And in this pan, I've got a little oil. And I'm just going to add in a dozen of these IKEA meatballs. We're frying away now. You might be able to tell I wasn't too prepared food-wise. <laughs> so I looked about the house. I had some frozen meatballs. I had some instant mash. And I've even got the uh, the gravy for the meatballs. Ikea style. But uh, yeah, it's going to do for tonight for sure. So what I'm doing here is a bit controversial. I'm going to add some water to here. Warm that up, and then I'm going to add in my gravy powder. So now I'm going to add in probably about half this pack. Something like that. And then hopefully that will work. <laughs> Okay, it's my mashed potato mixed up, and here's my meatballs. 
and the gravy which has thickened up quite nicely. I'd say that looks pretty good. Okay, it's meatball time. Let's try one. Hopefully cooked through. A little bit of that gravy. Oh, that's not half a one, that's a whole one. <laughs> I forgot. I forgot to bring my lingonberry jam. Mm. That's not bad. Never did I think I'd be eating IKEA meatballs in a tent in the snow <laughs> with ice dropping on it. Mm. warmed up quite a lot in here now. Um, just going to finish this tea, uh, get a little sorted in here and go to bed so probably see you guys in the morning. Very cold. Oh, my hands got numb. <laughs> I was out taking a few shots outside. <sighs> I had to process some of that um, kindling down a bit more. Oh, right. Let me get some feeling back in a minute. <laughs> I'm starting to warm up, except I've got the door open for a little bit of light. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, very cold this morning. All the snow has turned to ice out there. Um, Mark, he went an hour or two ago. I wasn't sure, I was half asleep when he said goodbye and packed up. He um, may have to be going to work today if he can get there, so he had to go quite early. Um, yeah, so just me this morning. So I don't have to share my breakfast because he didn't have any. <laughs> oh God. Yeah, it um, got down pretty cold last night. Um, I woke up uh, about 2 a.m., just needed to go out for a pee. 
and because I got up and everything all the heat was lost out of the sleeping bag so I lit the stove and uh, that went for an hour or so while I warmed back up and went back to sleep until me getting up at uh, 8 I think got the stove going now warm myself through a little bit get sorted <laughs> So you can see what I mean by the crunchy ice snow. Everything's frozen, all the snow frozen into ice. All of that um, dripping ice last night stopped after going to bed. And uh, yeah, gonna be a stiff tent pack away. Hopefully it'll thaw out a little bit with the uh, stove running. The zips were, you know, the zip pulls were frozen solid. <laughs> it is beautiful though. So glad to have got some snow. Hopefully not the last of it this year. Rare we get it kind of before Christmas. Usually in January or February or even March. A pretty standard breakfast today. I've got some sausages. So I'm going to stick them in a little bit of oil there. Well, it is a, a lot warmer in here now. And I have some nice hot food. Oh, Ooh, yeah, that's good. Bacon, perfect. Egg, perfect.
Well, that's me all packed up. I've probably got a, a few kilos extra weight in the ice in there, but uh, I got off what I could. Hope you enjoyed that. It's been lovely to have some snow again, although it wasn't particularly nice being rained on with ice last night. Uh, hopefully you'll stick around or we'll get some more. Until then, I'll see you next time. Goodbye.